That's some busted a Lambo, man. Actually, that's a Ferrari. That's what it is. That's, I think that's a Lamborghini. Oh, okay. We are surpassing a Ferrari. Right. <laughs> and now we are surpassing a Lambo. Uh, that's that the... Yeah. Yeah, Lamborghini. Yeah, okay. yeah. So one's a Ferrari, one's a Lamborghini, yeah. and that's why yeah. they look different. We're leaving Kosovo. A few hours from Tirana. I don't know when we get the border, maybe 30 minutes. But I wanted to take this little video and to paint the ironic picture. We're in Kosovo, what you would think is a bombed out country from 20 years ago. Poor Balkan country, got attacked by Serbia. A million refugees flee over the border, something like that. So you think a poor bombed out place, right? And yet, we have a Porsche. BMW and a Mercedes GT. <laughs> and we saw a Ferrari yesterday. Oh, and what's that over there? It's like a Bentley? Rolls Royce? Bentley? Uh, yeah, the R, that's a Rolls Royce right there. Yeah, Don't see those very often. Wow. Looks like a flat tire though. Oh, and then there's another Porsche behind him. So there's a Porsche. I don't think it's so much flat tire, it's, it's just a sport. Uh... No. Oh, so they inflate whenever you turn on the car. <laughs> Porsche and then Rolls Royce and then Mercedes GT and BMW and another Porsche. That's pretty good for a country that got bombed out 20 years ago. Yeah, man, but they need fast car, like fast and full. All right, for... and nice smooth roads. So it's not a poor Balkan country. They have lots of nice cars. Where did they come from? I don't know. They got dropped by uh, helicopters. So we're filling up the tank because gasoline in Kosovo is cheaper than Albania. Better quality than Morgan. And better quality. That is the reason why we do it. They guarantee 20% more distance for your tank. No, I'm just making up that part. Even more. No, no, even more. Oh. Right. Oh. Even more than 20%. Is that the highest mountain that we were looking at from the castle? No. Somewhere else? Yeah, 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 yeah. Should be, uh, so we're in the Mission Impossible tunnel chase scene, two if there were one, and the two lamp, the two light blue Lamborghinis that we passed at I the one, one border mile. check, and then also at the. That's <laughs> gorgeous. Yeah, we're going 100 miles now. Really? Wow. Yeah. Yeah. So they they passed us. Those guys were. Uh, there's the two sky blue Lamborghinis that just passed us on the left. They weren't going that fast. Um, but we passed them at the uh, tollway where we paid five euros and they were over on the right side just parked, <laughs> taking photos of themselves, selfies um, on the side of the road. And originally we saw them when we were at the border check and they both came out of the customs parking lot. And uh, the speed limit is 100 kilometers per hour. Right, but they're going 140 so kilometers per more hour. More than 140 because uh, we're hour. going 100. Yeah, we're going 145, and they're probably 150. Not much faster than us. I cannot catch them. And right. I cannot maintain uh, too long this yeah. uh, speed because it's uh, danger in the, uh, in the curves. But yeah, there's a guy. There's a kind of a middle-aged guy in each car, and no. then there his their their female companion on each one. Sorry. So that's all they do. If you have a Lamborghini, you just drive it around probably all day, every day on, on the highways. And I bet tomorrow they're gonna come back because this is the best road in the country. So they'll probably come back the other way tomorrow. And then the next day they'll go back that way. It's not the best road in the country. Actually, they're not twins. They're actually a different design. You see the back. So they're yeah, different. Actually, they're well, different uh, models. It's just that they're the same color. I, originally, when I saw them, I thought they were the same car, but they're I not. I think th this one here is a uh, newer. So mm. so now you will see how fast they go. Yes. No, actually, they are not going fast. Uh, I'm just going to set the camera here. And... We are passing a Lambo. We are surpassing a Lambo. Yes. We are surpassing a Lambo, man. Oh, actually, it's a Ferrari. That's what it is. That's, I think that's a Lamborghini. Oh, okay. 
we are surpassing a Ferrari right. <laughs> and now we are surpassing a Lambo uh, that's that the... yeah yeah Lamborghini okay so yeah. one's a Ferrari one's a Lamborghini yeah. and that's why yeah. they look different yes winners yes you Lambo Ferrari okay now I need to slow down because right. I think you should catch when, the when we get to Tirana we should uh, find them and ask if their emotional feelings were damaged <laughs> and, then, and then offer to buy them Buruk and an espresso. In this game, I'll be able to say, uh, did it hurt? Did it hurt? <laughs> buy you a Buruk. How about an espresso? So these are the two Lamborghinis. CosoNutrition.nl, which is this website. It's Coso, like Kosovo. Uh, NL for Netherlands and so they sell supplements you know protein powder and pre-workout and all those things the two guys we saw them outside of the car they were I don't know I can't tell how old they were they were across the road but between 25 and 40 years old <laughs> something like that not not too young like 18 but not too old either it wasn't as if they had <laughs> uh, investments that had you know tr stocks and bonds and trusts and all these finances that grew over time they had new money and they got it quickly uh, by some means maybe they're just business entrepreneurs that were successful in competition with all the other supplement stores.